Hi everybody, this is Sal with Moon Valley Nurseries and we're talking about pests and disease that might be in your home and landscape around your house. One of the things that we occasionally see coming in the nursery is what's called aphids. If you're familiar with them, you absolutely know what I'm talking about. They do a doozy on your plants. So one of the things we want to talk about is how to identify it when we see it brought in the nursery. If you're not sure what you got, please bring in samples, bring in pictures, bring in the leaves, bring in the flower buds, whatever you think that they're on. You can bring in a Ziploc bag so it doesn't get all over your car, but we'll take a look at it and identify the plant and what it's on, and we can usually tell from there. They're pretty darn easy to see. Sometimes they're like reddish color, brown color, green color, almost clear, but they're like these little bumps that are all over your blooms a lot of times, up and down the limbs of your plant. We see them on things like oleanders and roses, just to name a few. So they can be pretty prevalent in your landscape. And once they get in there, they really spread quick and they do a lot of damage. They also leave behind different types of mold. So it can kind of cause and foster that. We want to really treat these guys aggressively once we realize what we got going on. So let's kind of talk through that. Let's talk treatment first. One of the things I love to see our clients do is kind of treat it from the inside out. Use a systemic drench. This, this pesticide will kind of active through the roots. We're gonna pour it in there, right with one of a bucket, the, the chemical itself. And we want to pour that all around the plant, get it soaked up into the leaves, into the limbs, the buds, the blooms, everything. And any type that these guys are living off the plant, sucking off the plant, which is really what they're doing, that pesticide's getting in their system, it helps get rid of them, it kills them. The other thing we like to do is use malathion. Malathion is a fantastic product for kind of a contact kill, if you will. So the way to do that is to mix that, follow these labels, follow these instructions, and really coat and soak the plant top to bottom. So we're gonna treat it from the inside out with that systemic treat it over the top, contact kill, if you will, with the malathion. So this works excellent for that, and I strongly recommend the moment you see it come in so we can help you get that going. The next thing we need to do is really kind of check on your, your watering and the health of the plant. So let's go through and we'll ask questions about the plant, where it's at in your yard, what it is, how old it is, and get your watering fixed. That also aids for preventative maintenance in the future, which is super important. And last but not least, we really need to make sure your plant's getting fertilized. A lot of times when they've gone into your yard and your landscape around your house, they've done enough damage where it's kind of injured the plant to a degree. We want to push that growth off. We want to push new growth along. So we're going to use stuff like moon juice. It's really a great shock to the system for the roots, for the plant itself, kind of brings some life back into it. And then moon dust. Moon dust is really meant to push new growth, new blooms, as well as a little bit of roots. But we really want to put those two together and get your plant going. And now we want to talk again, kind of that preventative maintenance for the following season, the following year maybe really watch your watering. Come see a nursery pro. We've got amazing watering guides. We can see if it's an old plant, new plant, give you the best advice possible. The other thing, again, we're gonna go through and make sure we're fertilizing with the right product at the right time of year. So come see us so we can identify what it's on and make sure we're treating it the right way for you. But if you guys ever encounter this pest or anything else in your yard, you have any questions or you just wanna walk through this amazing nursery, we've got a great place, guys. Come and see us, we're glad to see you. Hopefully we see you in a nearby Moon Valley nursery really soon. Thanks.